well excited. Anime? Nighty night. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to bed. <laughs> a bomb? I did that already. There's a bomb yeah, strapped so, uh, to my chest! It's gonna blow up! I know up this is the fifth seconds. time we've done this, but, you know, just in case for anybody watching, welcome to the uh, Ace Attorney Dual Destinies. We don't need the that. whole building is gonna blow up. Why, why are you guys... Respect, fuck, nigga. No, 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 I don't even... That wasn't respectful at all. The Krusty Krab you know... bombing of 2003. <laughs> <laughs> You know, this reminds me of a, tra a trauma team. Not trauma team, but uh, there was a bomb in one of those games. You remind me of Philadelphia. There was a bomb in trauma team, actually. These are dark times where the law has been reduced to rubble. Nah, I see and what you did there. You sure we're not watching in the anime? Glory. It's got voice acting. Yeah, I know what you mean. It looks like your target finally decided to make a move. Don't you worry. I've got a trusty new partner on board. Who the fuck is that? We have new a new character. main character. Done. Damn, she's really anime. She's been with us for half a year. You think this is gonna get clean? I can hardly believe it. I hope so. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> it's the beginning of that song, Granddad. Be our greatest weapon. All right. <laughs> Let's go. Die! 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 <laughs> Are you all right, Miss? Jesus. Damn, she got no, that no, no. Pokemon. Yeah, a normal protagonist. person so might break all of their bones doing that. But she's built different. Yeah, it's like, yeah, once you join this agency, you're just invincible. She <laughs> <laughs> was already built different when she fell up the stairs, but... Well, let's go, time to It makes out. perfect sense. Well... But he's fired, man. What the fuck? What do you mean, time to sit? Nah, he got a shit back. He got a shit back up uh, there, uh, Apollo Justice. He got a yeah. shit back. Yeah, that's like he the got thing. that shit on. Oh my god, he, he, he got his badge back. Alright, right the foot. And... Wait, fucking four. Play the game if you want to know how. <laughs> how you go from we got this shit on to four? Four. I'm a blood shot. And, and now he has an additional mask ugly as hell. His, under his suit. <laughs> Who the so who's fuck is Raven? that? Oh. Dang. That's uh... Evil nigga. Yeah, Evil nigga. Introducing punished Apollo. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what happened? The fuck? Also. Dude is Sasuke now, also, what the fuck? <laughs> Foreshadowing about the moon being in his eye for later. Oh man, man, that shit happened. Damn, I didn't know our time fucking with Edward. Eye. That's a spoiler. Yeah, goddamn. Dude, really turn into Sasuke. It's gonna betray <laughs> us. What the fuck? That's me. That's me. That's me. That's me, nigga. <laughs> the best part about making bomb is knowing that lawyers <laughs> don't know how to. <laughs> That no one actually knows Good to Smitty, you glasses, bro. The best part about making meatballs <laughs> is blowing niggas. <laughs> and it's important to know this because lawyers don't deserve anything. Now all I have to do is... <laughs> you know what? Yeah, you're right. That's exactly what you said. That is what and everything, I'm a little girl. <laughs> Let's go. December 17th, 1922. They want to be tabled so bad. They don't got no facial features. We really... <laughs> Oh, You're really gonna get a new narrator. Like a Holy fuck. Is that her name, Athena? Right. Yes. Oh. Yep. Yeah, this is Athena Sykes. Hmm, nope, not feeling nervous at all. <laughs> it's Wanda's daughter. Yeah, no relation. It's amazing what a girl can get used to. Even in a tense atmosphere like this is no biggie. <laughs> you ladies okay? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. Oh, shit. Damn. I already forgot what voice I gave. Oh, Apollo! I don't even think you gave him a voice. Right. Yeah, doing great! Like, uh, a <laughs> little doing great. Oh, yeah? Well, that's good to hear. Although... I could've sworn I heard your voice crack for a second there. Damn. Oof, I'm that transparent, huh? Could've just ignored that. 
cracking? No, my voice isn't cracking. Nerves of steel here, I tell you. Good cheese and hard as hell. Horny ass on. This is Apollo Justice. Bruh. He's a fellow lawyer at the office I work for. Apollo was the lead for the defense on this case. I'm just gonna be there at the bench with him, doing what I can to help out. That's right. I'll do whatever it takes to defend Junie. Oh my god, bench. Speaking of steel, how are you holding <laughs> up? The, the bomb really did a number on you. Yeah, I'm just happy that you're okay, Athena. Although, I can't pretend I have no connection to this case. That's why I'm going to see to it that Juniper's name is cleared. I'm sure you feel much the same way. You got that right. I won't rest until Junie is completely cured, cleared of all suspicion. That's you, Edgeworth. No, that's, that's her, the girl. That's Steven. <laughs> Thank you for doing this for me. Junie! Damn, Yo. she's smoking weed. Pussy ass nigga. Hey, you all right? Sorry about that. I always seem to go into coffin fits whenever I don't take my meds. <laughs> this kind of thing ha <laughs> happens in the forest, though. Cough. That shit loud. <laughs> this is Juniper Woods. <laughs> No, Junie, she, no, holding it not in to be, do Not to be confused with the Pokemon professor. Yes, he is. Yeah, that. She's my dear, dear childhood friend, and she's also our client for this case. And this keeps repeating that Junie is the alleged bomber. <laughs> it's ridiculous. There's no way she would do anything like that. They do say that appearances can be deceiving. I brought you a little snack, Athena. Just something from my garden. Oh, I hope it has weed in it. Um, so uh, is this an orange or a tamarind? Imagine eating weed uh, oranges. <laughs> Not in this addiction. one. You gotta kill yourself. <laughs> it's an orange, <laughs> as my grandma says. That orange is the color of strength and Fat endurance. Orange. <laughs> oh, I get it. Strength for the trial, right? Jenny, you're always so good to me. Jeez, well, look food. at me. Standing here clutching an orange to my chest with tears in my eyes, praying it has fint in it. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> well, don't you worry. <laughs> It'll be so powerful they won't know what hit him. Right, Apollo? Fint attorney. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm what may. This is one trial we just can't lose. That nigga Let's died. go. <laughs> passed already. away already. Uh, Apollo. Apollo, get your ass up. Oh. <laughs> nigga was not. Damn. Blood is sleeping through his bandages. One of his rooms must have reopened. All this time he was trying to put on a brave face, but he was really overdoing it. And when he used to go to the hospital. Mr. Bucket. Look, it's a phone. Huh? Oh yeah, the trial's about to start. <laughs> um, Get y'all asses all on. Get in the courtroom. What? Now? Well, he's in no state to defend. He's literally bleeding all over the floor. He's <laughs> 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 so far away. I have to defend Juniper. What are we gonna do? The trial's about to start with, without us. There's only one other option I can think of at a time like this. Even if I called him right now, he'd never get here in time. Now wait, there's something else I could do. Apollo, give me all the evidence for the case. Huh? What are you gonna do? Bailiff? Yes, miss. The defense would like to submit a substitution of attorney petition. Lena? 
You're not seriously. You just concentrate on not bleeding all over the floor. I'll defend Jenny. All by yourself? Athena, stop for a second, think about what you're saying. You've never once taken a case out alone before, right? No hey problem la. I can handle it, I think. That was racist. But I guess it really is up to you, Junie. Would you be okay with me taking over? Well, you don't like bilingual people, um, Darian? Sure. I no believe comment. in you, Zena. So that's <laughs> enough for me. Bilingual people are she, committing... She uh, isn't just bilingual. She knows a bunch of different languages. You're worried for me, aren't you? To be honest, I'm pretty nervous, too. Uh, I think my heart just might burst out of my chest and turn to a bump. But you're in no shape to stand at the bench right now. So you'll just have to leave it up to me. His honest reaction. Alright. See, your mind's made up anyway. I hate it that I can't be there, but I know you'll give your utmost to defend Juniper. You bet I will. Rest assured of that. Damn, game just started and I already got sidelined. I'm washed. <laughs> My name is Athena Sykes. Still just a newbie, but uh, I'm a lawyer. You believe did a number on him. This is the oh, only second time I've taken a lead in my defense case. You said Shibuya did a number on him? Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> That's one. <laughs> Damn, we just started. It'll be the first time I stand up there alone, though. I had to do this. I'm definitely not about to let anything bad happen to Juni whatsoever. <laughs> However, we're not getting paid for all of that. <laughs> December 17th, 9.46 a.m. He's bad as fuck. What if he does Fent? Huh? Can y'all erase Fent from your vocabulary, please? Can you That's erase JJK? Awesome. Court is now in session. Ooh, You're the man of the impossible. Shit. Right Blue. Oh my god. We're so back. 3D judge. <laughs> yep. We are. We are. <laughs> Court is so now in session. For the trial of Juniper Woods. Yeah, your honor. <laughs> Darren. This dude. I'm playing him. Yeah. You gotta. Uh, it is here. Uh -huh. Nigga five. Hmm. The prosecution's also ready, your honor. Uh, uh, yeah. This uh -huh. dude every time. And what's the meaning of this? I was under the impression that Mr. Red Monkey would be my opponent today. Whoa. Yo. Uh, racism aside, a <laughs> substitution of attorney petition was submitted just a few moments ago. Due to the explosion in the courthouse yesterday, Mr. Justice is unable to continue. I see, I see. Not at all surprised to use that as an excuse to run away, bitch ass nigga. Imagine. With me as an adversary who wouldn't want to feign illness in order to escape. For sure. Uh, crush, crush What's the nerve of this guy? I'm gonna give him a piece of my mind. Well, uh, I would if I wasn't so nervous. This arrogant jerk. You arrogant jerk. I don't know, is it? Is my hearing getting worse? I could have sworn I heard the defense just say something. No, you didn't hear anything at all, especially not from me. <clears throat> oh. I could have sworn I also heard something. Oh, uh, that would be my indispensable partner, would it? He sometimes words out what I'm thinking. Yeah, no, it would suck if she was very or some shit like that. Well then. How are you gonna lie and then tell yourself? If that's the case, then it's a clear contradiction to what you just stated. Bro, we're all Literally. We haven't even started yet. Yeah, you failed right now. Contradiction? <laughs> you just stated that you said nothing. However, if that device of yours says what you're thinking, 
then you indeed said what I was. The uh, what was it? Elegance at work. Yep. Actually, it was an arrogant jerk. <laughs> Damn, why she look like that? Fuck. At any rate, what does it matter if red monkey or a yellow monkey is facing me? Yo, this nigga's wilding. <laughs> no, fresh off the boat. <laughs> <laughs> no, fresh out of law school. Ricky, in all caps, is gonna defend this witness. All right. Let's go. Mr. Kane, I believe that's enough. <laughs> Let us get back to the case. Yeah, of course, Your Honor. I'm more than ready to show this little girl why they call me the Rookie Humiliator. Yeah, man. <laughs> I know it. He really, really? is an arrogant Him? jerk. Arrogant jerk. That's, that's I think too they called him. I think in the original they called him the Rookie Killer. <laughs> Damn. I, I guess they, uh... I guess they changed that because they didn't want the word Some really killer? bad in my mind. I guess no. <laughs> that's an odd oh, change Miss, if that's the case. Miss Sykes, if you continue to insult the prosecution, I will remove you from this court. I'm very sorry. Just a knee-jerk reaction. She's very expressive. Yeah, yeah I was about to say that. <laughs> <laughs> now then, uh, Mr. Payne, your opening statement, if you please. Uh, thank you, Your Honor. <laughs> now then, the incident occurred yesterday here at this very courthouse in courtroom number four. At that time, the trial for a certain bombing was being held in courtroom number four. I, oh, whoops. Judge. <laughs> Oh, yes, I was presiding for that trial as well. And Mr. Justice was there as the lawyer for the defense. A bomb that was being presented as evidence suddenly went off during the trial. It was a terrible incident, and the courtroom number four was completely destroyed. Fortunately, we were able to start evacuation procedures before the explosion occurred. Just a few more seconds more and we would have all died. How convenient, man. Uh, but there was, in fact, uh, one death, was there not? That is correct, Your Honor. When courtroom number four was examined after the blast... Aw, oh, dang. The body of De uh, Detective Candace Arm was discovered. I hate it when a bad bitch dies! <laughs> she was to take the stand as a witness later in the trial. I suppose she wasn't able to evacuate in time. What a terrible fucking tragedy. I must admit... I stumbled at least ten times before I was able to make a stay. Uh, fuck. I mean, uh... <laughs> the court should see to getting you even shorter robes. As I mentioned, it's coming early. Uh, the, vic <laughs> the victim's body was found near the entrance to the courtroom. I suspect she stayed until the very end to help guide the others out to safety. Your Honor, allow me to submit as evidence the victim's autopsy report. And details about the bomb. Cause of death. Trauma to back of head caused by impact with a flat object. Time of death between 8 and 11 a.m. They're gonna show the bomb and it's just gonna be a... Uh... Stuffed oh, animal bomb. The time bomb that destroyed the courtroom. It was hidden inside a stuffed animal when it was detonated. Oh, these aren't stuffed animals. They're bombs. <laughs> <laughs> these are made in a, a bomb factory. Is a bomb factory. They're bombs. Okay, I know how this works. All evidence for the trials <laughs> filled in the court record. When I want to check something out, I just press button. I better take a peek later. Now then, please call the accused to the stand.
back off. Well, I'm defended. Are you uh, feeling right eye? And you're looking a little pale. I'm so sorry. I was feeling a bit weak when I first arrived here in the courthouse. Cough. But I... I'm alright. That's me with markers. <laughs> Junie's really giving it all. I better make sure I do the same. If I would please proceed. Oh, whoops. If we could please proceed. <laughs> your name and occupation, defendant. <laughs> Juniper Woods. I'm a high school student. Miss Woods, can you confirm you were in the courthouse on the day in question? Yes. I came to know Apollo Justice through my friend Thena. Cough. And so, when I was there yesterday to watch his trial to lend my support. Wrong. Junie's really scared. <laughs> Did you know I'm also known as the Defendant Humiliator? It looks like I have yet another chance to show everyone how I earned that moniker. Er, this is arrogance no no bounds to protect Junie no matter what. Hey, you arrogant uh, prosecutor, Payne. What is it? Do you want me to demonstrate why I'm known as the rookie humiliator instead? Deep breaths, Athena. Don't let them get to you. Prosecutor Payne, Junie's telling the truth. Mr. Justice also backed up her claim when we saw him in the defense lobby. Defendant lobby. And Junie said he was glad to... Give the get the lotus root you gave him too. He was. My grandma says that lotus root is good for your eyes. She says they can even help you see into the future. Shoot, can I? They can. That's the perfect present for a lawyer. Yeah, if that's true. I guess he must not have eaten them. Mm -hmm. A sweet meat girl like this blowing a courtroom to bits? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now, now, Your Honor, don't let her seemingly innocent appearance fool you. The defendant had a motive for committing this crime. That's not true. I, I don't have any kind of motive. And I, I didn't even know the lady who was killed. I admit the investigation didn't turn up any connection between the victim and defendant. However, that doesn't matter. The only thing that does is there is her objective was the whoops. I read that wrong. The only thing that does is their what the hell? The, the only, only thing, thing that, that does, does is that her objective was the destruction of courtroom number four itself. Damn, I need to stay in school. <laughs> Dumb motherfucker. What's that supposed to mean? What in the world would Miss Woods want to do that? Why in the world? Hmm. That's a very good question, coming from a novice such as yourself. But first, a question for the defendant. Have you ever been brought up on false charges? Like right now? What? <laughs> Why, yes. Yes, I have. Did that experience cause you to harbor a grudge against the court system? Now wait just one minute. If that kind of thing the motive of blowing things up, and every one of our clients would turn into mad bombers. Turn into terrorists. <laughs> That's a valid point. We wouldn't have a single courthouse left landing uh, left standing in the land. <laughs> concede the accused isn't the only one who might bear resentment against the courts. But Miss Woods is the only person who could have committed this crime. Why? Because we have found some decisive evidence that proves the defendant's guilt. Decisive, huh? I'll believe when I see it. It involves a very unique aspect of the bomb itself, Your Honor. And what exactly was so, uh, unique about it 
Hmm. No. Why don't we have Miss Sykes answer that question? Huh? Me? Mm -hmm. I noticed that you appear to be very nervous, and well, gentleman that I am. I'd like to offer you the chance to gain some confidence with such an easy question. Could he be even any more condescending, Rosie? What a thoroughly unpleasant man! Rosie's for loser. Loser. And it's loser. What did you just say? Nothing. Not a single thing. Now let's see. What was I supposed to do at a time like this? Oh, I know. The court record. The information I need is somewhere inside the court record. All right, uh, Miss Sykes. Uh, let us hear your answer. What was unique about the bomb that flew up in the court? Was it because it was... Inside a stuffed animal. I mean, that's true, but I, I also wanted to check the court record. Man, you shiny bitch. Next. Let's, <clears throat> Let's go to the autopsy. The bomb. Details? Oh. Okay. Oh. Mm. Um, I guess we'll... I don't understand what's hidden inside of stuff anymore. Anyway. Can we look? Can we look at the autopsy report real quick? We gotta, we gotta check the autopsy report. The detail. Oh, it's just a picture. Oh, okay. That shit is not on our ear. <sighs> All right, go. Let me go see the bomb. Oh, never no. mind. We can, no, we can go bomb real quick. Okay. So was the zipper where the bomb was hidden? You just unzip the and then there's a bomb there, like. I don't know. Let's find out. All right. Stuffy animal. Mister Payne, what kind of simpleton do you take me for? It was a stuffed and it was stuffed inside a stuffed animal. It's evil intentions covered up by a cute exterior. Very good. Have a cookie. The bomb that went off in the courtroom was inde indeed hidden inside the stuffed animal. This throws a package. It's a whole interface. Mm -hmm. How do you like that? Not bad, hmm? I am fine. To... Just like what I said from the start, I can do this. They're going back to basics with this one. <laughs> sure. As I recall, the bomb was a. Uh... Inside a stuffed animal the whole time. I never even got to take a look at it. But what connection does this impish elephant have with the defendant? Bars. What the hell? The answer to that question lies in another piece of evidence, which I have here. And, uh, what the fuck is that? Appears to be a, a little bit singed, a little bit crispy. It's a failure, Honor. The tale of a poor victim in the explosion. That's incredible. Are you saying that's Detective Autumn's tale? Uh, Your Honor's so very close, but no. It belongs to this stuffed animal. It's called the Phony Fanty. A rather unpleasant name, if you ask me. Don't fuck with Fanny, bro. Uh, I was trying <laughs> hard <laughs> to avoid the that. Fenty, Fenty. <laughs> oh, I wasn't even thinking oh, that. God. I was thinking about fucking Rihanna. Bro. The Fenty, Fenty. All right. The Fenty. He's been. Uh, 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 I mean, uh, <clears throat> sorry, I had a burp. He's the mascot for a campaign to eliminate false evidence and false charges. Is he not? Exactly. His motto is phony evidence is just trunked up. That's so wrong on so many levels. The phony Fanty's tail is made out of vinyl cloth. And we found something very interesting on its surface. 
the defendant's fingerprints. <gasps> what? Oh no! The phony Fanti provided the prosecution with all the evidence we needed. It clearly proves that the accused handled the bomb. Bars. Uh, uh, yep. <laughs> Shit, we got a panning camera? Oh my goodness. Look at those budget. silhouettes, bro. We see every I angle it, of the... <laughs> They got, the, they got the budget now for it. That doesn't make any sense. Why would Junie's fingerprints be on it? Mm. That does appear to be uh, pretty irrefutable evidence. The court accepts it into evidence. The piece of stuff animal that the bomb was inserted to. The defendant's fingerprints were on it. Miss Woods, do you have an explanation for this? I... I don't understand. I... Cough. Cough. How about you, Miss Sykes? Do you have any plausible explanation to refute the divisive piece of evidence? Divisive? Oh, brother. Oh, uh, well, I, um... Uh, I can't do it! I can't think of anything! Better come up with something for Junie's sake. If you can't produce an answer, we could always go straight to the ruling, if you prefer. Back no, I have to say something fast. Faith Black. Oh no! I can't get my voice to work! Why now of all times? Yo. Flashback. I thought I overcame this already. Maybe I'm still not ready to stand in court. Oh, hey, cutscene. Uh, animated cutscenes? Yo, how much money they got over there at Capcom? Can I have some? Damn. Man, Danganronpa? Yo! That's a Danganronpa for real. Nah, the boss not thing. Oh, damn. I'm only three. Damn, she black. Fuck you, Manny. <laughs> no, she did it. She definitely killed him. <laughs> this looked yeah, tough. Yeah. Oh, Manny, yeah. I got two first. Yeah, she guilty as hell, man. Beat you to it. For debate. <laughs> Objection! What? Why That's it's it? you. I guess, bro. I don't know why I gotta hold this nigga's hand, but... <clears throat> Paula probably told her on her ass. It's like, what the fuck is she doing? Get her ass out of here. <laughs> the transit. <laughs> kind of funny. All lives matter, Athena. My bad. Sorry it took me so long to get here. <laughs> no reason at all. <laughs> no reason. Paula explained the whole thing to me over the phone. He asked me to come help you out in this in this place. Thanks for coming. Do you know me, man? I hate to admit it, but I was having a real tough time on my own. Uh, I don't know. Think I think you were doing just fine, all things considered. And you hung in there, giving me enough time to get here. Now, let's turn things around. You got it, boss. <laughs> Big Daddy just came in a... Yo, what? yo, <laughs> we, didn't uh -huh. hear, we didn't hear you. Yeah, you didn't. Quite. God damn it. <laughs> I heard well, we, what's big is the, I heard, we heard the I heard, first part. I heard Big Daddy. Daddy Long Dick just flew into town. Okay, we'll double down, real shit. <laughs> if it isn't Mr. Phoenix Wright, you always manage to surprise No, Pan's are pissed. Your Honor, Mr. Payne has called for an early ruling. Why are you coming here slamming already? But I believe there are still many things that need to be uh, deli- mm -hmm. <laughs> See, I know the word, but I almost said the hard R, so I'm gonna just stop right there. How did Miss Wood's <laughs> fingerprints wind up on the stuffed animal tail? How was the bomb even detonated? Until these questions are answered, I assert dominance that it's impossible for a ruler, fair ruling to be made. Buddy, boy, the boy, 
You are absolutely right. I know, I know. We continue from where we left off. I assume you have no objections? Mr. Kramer. Nah, he don't got none. <laughs> Not at all, Your Honor. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Cough. Mm -hmm. Cough. 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 Hey, yo, cough. die elsewhere. Miss Woods really looks like she's having a hard time. Judy's really struggling, Mr. Wright. I get the sense she's afraid of the courtroom herself. It's a... Because of yesterday? Yeah, it was understandably very traumatic for her. Poor thing. And here she is, back at the courthouse again, being so brave. I'd like to make a request, Your Honor. If at all possible, I'd like to have Miss Woods rest in the lobby. Very right. I grant special permission. That's the beard covering up his mic. You go get some rest, Junie, and leave the rest to us. Unfortunately, this is a fairly directional mic, so sometimes I don't have it in the right direction. Okay. Finish it on everybody. Thank you. Sorry about this. Cough, cough. It just gonna... fades out of existence. <laughs> no, okay. go. Gonna go get those meds. The weed. Phoenix Wright. <sighs> Here we go. He's a fan I'm of me. He loves me. Forward to meeting you. So which yeah. pain is this? The the third one. The third pain. It's been a brick. All the pains. Mr. Of, pain. All the pains of until now have been the same person. Except him. <laughs> no, they're phantom pains. Six paths <laughs> of pain. <laughs> You're more clueless than I heard. I do believe you mean. How do you do? For I, in gasping pain, that's a lame ass first name. I am the younger brother of your long standing rival, Winston Payne. Damn, this is oh, the same that's person. why you're a bitch ass nigga. I was like, why are you acting like he's Kobe on the court? Like he's Kelly Uber at best, but okay, he's a different nigga. Long standing <laughs> rival? When were we ever rivals, let alone long standing? Uh, you'll see, Mr. Wright. I will cleanse Winston of the disgrace he met with your hands. Uh, with that your hand. <sighs> Looks like this royal pain is gonna be as thoroughly unpleasant as the other. Uh, so he actually has Gaspin is Gaspin is way worse than Winston ever was. Just yeah. by what he does in this game and by what he does in the next game. Good grief. Power scaling pain. <laughs> Let's go. Your Honor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the prosecution would like to uh, call the decisive witness to the stand. That was spoilers, but we're not going to talk about it. <laughs> this, uh, this witness will testify as to how the accused then. Uh, God, Lee. This witness will now testify as how the accused detonated the bomb in the courtroom. Very well. Please call your witness, Mr. Payne. <laughs> Yo. The fuck? Mm, one of the police officers. Witness, your name and occupation, please. That is not the Vision Pro. Uh, witness? H hell no, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> name. Oh my Ted god, I wonder who the culprit is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, what, Blue? He said, I wonder who the I culprit, wonder who is. culprit is. <laughs> yes, yeah. this is the imposter. <laughs> <laughs> Occupation Bomb Disposal Specialist. Oh Lord. my! <laughs> what a strange robotic voice you have! Oh my god, my throat is killing me. I'll be right Speech back. Speech synthesis via typing. It is the same as me talking. Oh, it's Stephen Hawking of this game. <laughs> Let's go, bro. Minus the Sounds uh, the island. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sounds exactly like a robot. <laughs> well, as far as we know. Can't you speak in a normal manner? Damn, is that oh, racist no. against robots? I mean, I can. He can. But I do not like to speak. Speaking is inefficient. Inefficient, but typing I it is? I not to speak. If I speak, I'm in big trouble. Oh, you saw that. Energy expenditure. <gasps> speaking is greater than what? No, not. Uh, Hand versus mouth, I guess. Speaking, type, what? Uh, speaking, speaking is greater, greater than, than typing. Than, but he just said he 
Does it? never mind. Is he Rhea? Oh, energy. Mm. Okay, never mind. I I'm I'm dumb. I'm the Rhea. <laughs> Hmm, what an odd little... And not the first time. <laughs> Mr. Tenate was in charge of the bomb for that trial and was there when it went off. And they didn't question it? Being a bomb squad specialist, do you have any relation to the victim? Hell nah. I met, first met the girl while on this job. <laughs> Many people are employed by the police. I only know a fraction of them. However, I was shocked when I first discovered the body of the victim. What? I was the first one on the scene after the explosion. I went there to ensure safety, but I ended up discovering a dead nigga. Hmm, so he was the first to discover the body, was he? He is here to testify about the circumstances surrounding the moment of the explosion. <laughs> Very well. The court will hear Mr. Tonate's testimony. But at the very least, show some damn respect and move that fucking face forward. Witness. Oh, shit. Oh well. Nigga sir. Ooh. The yeah. bomb was originally disarmed by me, then transported here as evidence. Bomb name HH Greg, operated by timer or with remote. Hey. I was watching from the gallery when I suddenly became alarmed. I saw that bomb's what? timer was counting down. Like Squidward's technique. <laughs> he saw the timer? Wasn't the shit closed? Hmm. So even though the bomb was supposed to be disarmed, it somehow got switched on? Precisely. Activating the timer is very simple. I, one, connect wires. Two, switch on timer. A monkey could do it. I'm Yo. sure you would be able to do it. Tables. Okay. No, nah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Damn. Yeah, that's cool. This is, family this, guys. this is like the fourth monkey tonight. What's going on right now? I guess this makes you the blue monkey in this barrel of fun, boss. Thanks. <laughs> oh my goodness. I now like to begin my cross examination. Huh? Nigga! You run! <laughs> 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 Immediately, bro. H.H. H. Greg, a.k.a. They're bombs. A bomb? He raised yeah. immediately. Let's go. They're gonna fade it out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Turn that shit off. Why he duck it under like that's about to help? Oh, shit. Oh, shoot. This assembly complete. Okay, that's not fair though, because you know what it is. 5.3 seconds. 0 0.02 seconds short of my personal best. Dude is a speedrunner. <laughs> Dude's a speedrunner. You got a lot of damn nerve. I ain't going like I used to be. This is an exact replica of the HH Greg. Bruh, it not is again. used to practice disarming bombs. Disarm equals success. Explosion equals failure. Failure. It's not repeating. Bomb that exploded, is it? So that's what it like. I submitted a photograph of the real bomb taken just before the trial. Oh, got this shit hanging out. <laughs> Dimensions 10 feet in height. 10 feet. Wait, what? 10 inches. Wait. 10 inches height. 10 inches width. width. 10 inches depth. Yeah. Weight 12 pounds. Burst. A perfect replication. Or Republican. It is an elephant. <clears throat> <laughs> Your bomb does appear to be a very good copy indeed. Doc Yes. However, I could not replicate the detonation mechanism. It was. It has a very puzzling wiring setup. 
It is regrettable. I cannot replicate it. I was just saying that. Now that's enough. We ain't gotta replicate shit around here. It was hidden inside a stuffed animal and can be detonated remotely. Mm, and now, if the defense could begin their cross examination. Uh, uh -huh. Where has Miss Sykes gone to? Damn, she, she never came back. Tapes. Athena, you can come out now. Oh my god! Let's get to work! <laughs> I guess you were pretty scared, huh? What? I don't know what you're talking about. She was about to- She was oh. about to bolt. Hey, put a sock in it, Widget. <laughs> as transparent as ever. Now let's see, where were we? You were at the cross-examination? What do you mean, where were we? Oh yeah, cross-examination, of course. I wonder how Maya's doing. <laughs> Probably dead. Hopefully, she seems dis disoriented. I wonder if she's all right. Maybe I should ask Athena if she remembers how to cross-examine to help her focus. Nah, Would she'll be you right. like a tutorial? No. Nah, I don't need for that right now. She'll be all right. They played all the previous games. No tutorials I'll necessary. I'll do everything I can to help from the back of the bus. Well, if you what? find anything oh, oh. <laughs> funny, contradictions. <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> And flub up too often, don't be afraid to ask me for help. Press button when the option to consult with me appears. Bumbleclot. I'll let you know when I think the suspicious statement is. For the record, we are never using that. Oh, well, you definitely <laughs> will be later. That you know, sounds good. I'll be counting on you if, you, if I get in, the, in a bind. Alright, it's cross-examination time. We're gonna lose health. We, we're not... Chumps out here, all right. Chumps. <laughs> the court is for chumps. Where am I? <laughs> <laughs> the bomb was originally disarmed by me, then transported here as evidence. Oh yeah, by the way, you can see what statement you're on now. Oh, thank I God, mean, bro. Uh, next. So your help is I mean, in second I... now, not a bar. It's gonna... I was gonna say I could handle it before, but uh, yeah. this helps. Bomb name HH3000 operated by It is by slightly China. segmented, but oh. you can like see. I'm you can see it in little 20% increments. Yeah, you there. can see it. It's like a little black line. I was watching from the gallery when I suddenly became alarmed. From the gallows. Next. I saw that the bomb's timer was counting down. This is what we got. Bitch! Bitch! Uh, press. Oh. We're presenting or pressing? No, we can present. We can entertain these these children, I guess. What are oh, you want to do? Okay. I want to look at the bomb. See what it say. Because I mean, who the fuck is calling me? It's oh, they're gonna have to end it all with that one. Oh, it was an accident. <laughs> okay. Anyway, we can try that. I think it's that. Because I mean, how are you gonna see this shit close? Cool, cool, cool. If it's not that, then kick me out of all these videos. Damn. Yeah, there you go. Let's risk it. He made his bed. Objection! So you say you saw the bombs countdown, is that right? Of course. I clearly saw it counting down to zero. And I say that you are clearly lying. What are you talking about? There was no way you could have seen the bomb's timer. After all, the bomb was concealed inside a stuffed animal. Mr. Tanate, how can you claim to know the bomb was about to go off? When you couldn't even see the timer. God, but that. What? No! <laughs> Dude, <it popped laughs> yelling in the courtroom. <laughs> Niggas making fax machine noises. Mm, that, <laughs> that don't seem like a glaring inconsistent motherfucker. Indeed. Witness, how do you explain this? Uh, well, um, <laughs> you see, um. 
Well, that was great, Mr. Wright. Found a contradiction right off the bat. Oh, I always remember. I don't know why I thought it was her by mass. <laughs> remember <laughs> I missed that giant ass wall of text. Yeah. <laughs> when you find an inconsistency in a witness's testimony, there's always a reason behind it. it. Could be a lie, a hidden meaning, a secret. Whatever it is, it's up to us to dig it out. And pointing out every contradiction we find is the best way to do it, right, boss? Now the question is, what can we dig out of Mrs. Tonight? Well, let me see. I, um... No, 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 no. There must be some mistake. Oh, yes, of course. I remember now. The sound. I knew because of the sound. Oh, uh, what sound? When the timer of this type of bomb is switched on, it beeps softly. Beep. 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 It is the sound of the bomb counting down. Oh, uh, big noise, you say? Uh, I suppose it would be possible to notice that, even though the bomb is inside a stuffed fucking animal. I simply made a mistake. My bad. <laughs> My bad. Objection! Damn. You know, how in the world did you hear such a tiny little sound all the way from the gallery? Listening for the sound of a bomb's timer is an integral part of my work. I constantly undergo training so that I will never miss it. That's literally I never thing. miss. I, I never miss, think, Mr. Wright. I hardly think training would help you hear something so soft from so far away. I'm him. I'm him. <laughs> you do got family guy as eyes. What now? I've been saying. <laughs> Are you making light of the fine science of disarming bombs? It is a solo you. mission that I put my life on the line to perform. What kind of specialist would I be if I could not hear a bomb's timer? It's not like dissembling a toaster, you know. Now he's just showing off. Hmm. Nigga you built it! <laughs> Guys! <laughs> you keep asserting that the sound was too tiny to hear. But the only th tiny thing here is your skill as a lawyer. Being mistrustful is not an attractive quality, you know. Mm, and you're just overflowing with attractive qualities, aren't you? Bitch ass nigga. Hell with nigga. Or perhaps you have some proof that Mr. Tenate did not hear the sound? Well, no, but, uh... It still seems totally suspect. But it is, but it's going to be really hard to prove that he didn't hear something. Any fucking way, if I have this correct, the prosecution's argument is that... Someone reactivated the bomb before it was brought into the courtroom. What I don't understand, Mr. Payne, is why you believe that person to be Miss Woods. Uh, that's simple, Your Honor. Mr. Tenate happened to be there when it happened. He was there when the defendant rearmed the bomb. What the fuck? It happened before the trial started. I was. It was when Detective Arm and I were transporting the bomb. We brought the bomb to the lobby for the defense. Bomb equals evidence. The lawyer wanted to see it before the start of the trial. Looking for a chance to get at the bomb, Miss Woods was already there at the lobby. Her goal was suddenly to rearm the bomb and steal the remote switch. The remote switch? Yes, the switch that controls the bomb remotely. Duh. It has been missing ever since the incident. <clears throat> missing remote switch. A switch that starts the time bomb's countdown. It was stolen just before the blast and is now missing. I am partially to blame. I left the bomb and remote on top of the transport case, and they were rearmed and stolen while I was talking with the lawyer. 
uh, the defendant then used the remote from inside the courtroom to start the fight. Objection! How can you assert so uh, unequivocally that the bomb was uh, rearmed uh, re in the lobby? Objection! We're just gonna gloss over the fact that the bomb was just out and about in the first place? Anyways, <laughs> yeah. the bomb was safely secured in the transfer. Oh, there we go. It was safely secured in the blah 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 blah. The only time it was outside of the case was in that lobby, for whatever reason. Therefore, that was the only one and only opportunity anyone had to meddle with it. Someone other than Mr. Tony could have opened the case and taken the bomb out. Impossible. The transport case is assigned exclusively to moi. So, so you fucked up, got it. Do you That's see you. this number here? That is my identification number. And I have the only key that can open the case. That was you. Bomb transport. Yeah, case. Her, her, her. The case Tony and Detective Arm transported the bomb in. Tony has the W self report, bitch ass nigga. <laughs> Nevertheless, Mr. Payne's assertion is nothing more than conjecture. You have no proof that it was Miss Woods who stole the remote switch. And by the same token, you have no proof that it wasn't her. Oh, great. What I do have is a piece of evidence that proves the defendant handled the bomb. The fingers. Oh, the, what? Five minutes, 24 seconds. 2.3 deciseconds. The defense's advantage lasted a mere five minutes. Oh, those eyes are killing me. <sighs> Talk about a rotten hand. As long as they have her fingerprints as their trump card, I'm at big disadvantage. We will have to hear from the defendant herself. I wholeheartedly agree, Your Honor. I would like to recall Miss Woods to the stand. I trust you have no objections, Mr. Wright. <laughs> I'm worried about her condition, but we do need her testimony. On the other hand, I'm not sure I want to make Athena mad. Hmm. I can read your feelings, you know, boss. You can't do shit. Guess there's no hiding from her, huh? Don't worry. I know we need her testimony. What if anyone picks on her again? They'll die. Uh, I guess she's already at anger level one. Don't worry, I'll stop the proceedings before I let anything bad happen to her. The defense has no objections, Your Honor. <laughs> Don't let her get five bars. <laughs> five bars. Five seconds. In that case, I will take my leave. But before Spit I do, <laughs> there is one more thing, Mr. Wright, isn't it? Or is it? My bad. Oh, shit. Me? Yes? Dismantling bombs is my job. Dismantling the case is fair. yours. Do you think you can handle it? I look forward to seeing you try. Grr. This guy is hiding something. I just knows it. I just knows it. Now, if you will excuse me. It's the Super Mario 64. Fade out the sound effect. I was thinking the the Earthbound sound. It's that one sound in that fucking meme where mm -hmm. Dingy's like, "I play League of Legends," and then. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. <laughs> Go out into the lobby and drag the defendant back here. Jenny. Hi, Lena. She looks even worse than before. Damn, you don't gotta show it on your face, Edgeworth. <laughs> don't worry, Junie. We're here for you. Thanks, Nina. And I'll do my best, too. You blew up the courtroom because you bear <laughs> resentment <laughs> against the courts, correct? <laughs> nah, he fought for that. He fought for that. I'll give him that. It's a fucking just loaded question right off the bat. Like, <laughs> No. Of course not. I 
cough. No, I... you were embarrassed, ain't you? <laughs> so why'd you blow up the courtroom? What's that you say? I can barely hear you. Listen, I, I haven't done anything wrong. This prosecutor's scary. Objection! Oh, what an impudent little girl. Stop acting innocent and tell the truth. This is getting ugly. You rearmed the bomb because you wanted to blow up the courthouse. Admit it. That's why you went to the lobby where Mr. Justice was. Isn't that right? <laughs> Mr. Cool. Right. Can I go beat the shit out of him? What? Of course not. Do we have to courtroom manners 101 again? <laughs> we can't let a creep that bullies innocent girls like <laughs> get off this easy. <laughs> that little nigga on her chest mad as a bitch. You see him? I haven't forgotten about how he treated you. All right. Yeah, Big if, ass frown if, on you face. if you watch a widget, widget will usually reflect what Athena's feeling. So sometimes her the expression that she has will be different, but widget shows what she's truly feeling. <laughs> don't worry about me. That shit. I don't, I don't Just see no use. Junie. <laughs> yeah, like, follows her like. <laughs> her heart's crying out. She's so scared. So very scared. Looks like Athena's picking something up with her heightened sense of hearing. Like every time she sees a black person, a confederate flag shows up on Widget. And it sounds <laughs> like this uh, Mr. Woods, <laughs> Miss Wood's heart. Imagine. <laughs> Not even a feeling, bro. It's just... <laughs> that ass. Oh, it's, it's, it's a picture of Relizy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! Uh, don't deny it. You stole the remote switch and used it in the courtroom, didn't you? Objection. Your Honor, please put a stop to this. Mr. Payne is badgering the defendant. Oh, yeah. Cut that shit out. <laughs> Act like you got some bitches on your dick or something. I don't, I don't fucking know. Features whenever a kid's getting bullied in front of their eyes. <laughs> ah, but you do know what? But don't you know, Your Honor? There is no more a gentleman in this world than I. Uh, if a gentleman or even a gentleman would behave like he does, don't let that rude ruffian win. Say no. How dare you call a gentleman such as I a rude ruffian? I'll have you know, I attended a manners class every Sunday. Saturday, I think. This oh, one? yes. You need to go there weekly, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Figure that shit out when you were the child. I'm more than just a mere gentleman. I'm a genteel man. What? Not when you're terrorizing a young lady or not. I'll be tell the man my money back from that manners class if I were you. That nigga probably an abuser or something. Uh -oh. I should probably be the adult here and stop the two of them, but... This shit's funny. I don't want to see them die. Shut the fuck up. Uh, certainly, Your Honor. No further questions. Let's move on to the defendant's testimony. <clears throat> Miss Woods, please share with the court what you were doing when the bomb went off. She is not ready for this. Just crying the entire time. Well, that day, cough, I was watching from the gallery. Cough, cough. The bomb went off. Cough, cough. And rubble started falling. It fell on top of me. Cough, cough. Junie's clearly in pain, being forced to recall the bombing like this. I can't even get her words out. This isn't gonna work, so what now? Hey, wait a minute. Even if she can't vocalize what she wants to say, we can listen to what's inside her heart. Yes, now is the perfect time to use Athena's power. 
You can hear it, can't you, Athena? It's time for Athena's curse technique. <laughs> the cries of Miss Wood's heart. Yeah, Widget's actually her Shikigami. That's three. Let's <laughs> <laughs> go. It's going for a streak. Keep going. Keep going. Yes, and they sound incredibly strained. She's so scared. I think she could collapse at any second. Athena has a unique ability, you see. Every partner. With her finely tuned sense of hearing, she can hear the words words of a witness's heart. In essence, she can sense how a person is really feeling from the tone of their voice. This is all up to Athena and her special ability now. I actually really... I, I wouldn't say that I really like the, the gimmick that's coming up to this game, but I like that Athena just has the power to know exactly what someone is feeling emotionally. I think that's really cool. I think that's yeah. five, just how much sense it makes, just like how Apollo's gay is. He had like the, the different, the way they fidget their body, the way their body moves. And this is just They're like the tone of voice, so it's, it's mm -hmm. cool how they, <laughs> they over-exaggerate the smallest things. It's cool. I think it's tough. That's tough! Anyway, um, cool, bitch. <laughs> oh, my bad. I want... <laughs> and listen to the testimony of Miss Wood's heart. Nigga okay, just someone's out. <laughs> it's like, oh. <laughs> yeah, that's cool, Athena. Whatever, go away. <laughs> okay, nigga, we'll give it a go. After all, this is the reason I put all that effort into studying analytical psychology. Oh, she's a humanities major? Oh, yes, yes let's do it. Hey. Hey, what's up? Uh, what y'all doing over there? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Your holographic thingamabob. I just lost the screen. Here we go. Your holographic thingamabob can show us how Miss Woods is feeling, right? In a nutshell, yeah. The emotions right. and images that I picked up just now, listening to her testimony, you can enter all that into Widget and use the mood matrix to analyze them. Okay. These mood markers reflect flu have here reflect fluctuations in Junie's emotions. When she feels happy or is enjoying the memory, the happy marker lights up. When she feels angry or frustrated, the angry marker will react. It's just like Peach. Michael, what is Speed doing there? What? Hmm? What? <laughs> what are you looking at, dude? <laughs> you got a lot of fucking nerve. <laughs> <laughs> Does it feel so good, huh? When I notice Sonic, you notice speed. <laughs> oh god. I don't even know what either of them are talking about, honestly. <laughs> when she feels sadness or it's frightened by a memory, the sad marker will blink. Whatever you niggas are talking about. <laughs> when she feels surprised or confused, the surprise marker will let us know. Man, alright, nigga. So, with your special ability and Widget's Mood Matrix program, we can track how Miss Woods is feeling as she testifies. Talk about the wonders of technology. Yep, now let's give it a shot. <laughs> Picking up on some kind of Discord noise in June's heart, Judy's heart. You got groomed. My bad. Golly, what is your problem? Damn, you're right. <laughs> See here? Oh That's what the noise out. looks like in the Mood <laughs> Matrix. <I> missed it. <laughs> It's a result of inconsistencies between her testimony and her feelings. If you can pinpoint those inconsistencies, the noise levels should drop. It really is like trauma team. Okay, it's time to listen to Miss Wood's testimony then. True testimony or some shit. Uh, I guess you can reread this. Should I? Well. That day, cough. I was watching from the gallery. Cough, cough. The bomb went off. Cough. Cough. And rubble started falling. It Happy. fell on top of me. Cough, cough. What the fuck?
think I have a good grasp on Junie's emotional state now. This power of Athena's is incredible. I'm seeing an unexpected emotion that's inconsistent with the content of her testimony. What? Already? Fuck. <laughs> Look at this. When she and says it's all on top of me, into. the happy marker reacted. She's a masochist. Well, look at that. That is odd. There must be a reason for this contradictory, contradictory emotion. We gotta do some digging. When you find an unexpected emotion, you'll first need to pinpoint it and select the unexpected emotion or reaction from the four markers with button. So pinpoint the button Q. Pinpoint. You should. Pin okay, well, what she, she said. should not be happy that shit pinpoint. is falling up. Up. Oh. I was just explaining. <laughs> but, yeah. Lean with a fit. Widget is registry joy uh, when Miss Woods recalls the rubble falling on her. There must be a reason for this unexpected emotion. Miss Woods? As the rubble was falling, was there also something that made you feel happy? Okay, I don't know why you're like that. In front of all the holes like that, but. Off. Mr. Wright, the feeling of happiness is spreading through Junie's heart. Keep going! And I bet Junie will start to calm down. Great. Let's see what she has to say. Um, off. Just as I was about to escape the courtroom, the bomb went off. I was so startled, I tripped. And then the rubble started falling on me. I really thought I was done for. But just then, Apollo came and rescued me. Here we go. Hearts. Apollo? <laughs> He used his own body to shield me from the rubble. So that's when he sustained those injuries. That's what fucked him up. How do you feel, Junie? Did talking to Apollo give you some courage? Yes. Apollo is just like the sun. Strong and bright and warm. Warm. Just talking about him makes me feel like a leaf undergoing photosynthesis. 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 And see, your coughing stopped all of a sudden. Oh, you're right. Thank you, Thena. The fuck? The noise is at 50. The noise is stopping. The voices. Cut in half. Looks like we were able to draw some, some new testimony. <laughs> Pretty neat, huh? There's still some noise left, meaning there must be some discord in Junie's heart. Hmm. I guess we have to keep going then. Let me input this new information, update the mood matrix, <laughs> we'll be ready to go. He's just watching this bullshit. There's three of the same girl up there. Yeah. You remember? They're probably you remember what you do, right? Asshole. Why are they not together then? Because Are you always around your siblings? Assigned seats. Okay, but we're we're at a fucking court. That's different if we're like, you know, we're in the same place. We may as well be together there doing jury duty. No, oh, like the Bitch. jury duty. They're, they're not the jury, they're the gallery. <laughs> yeah, like, Man. Yeah. Japan, Japanese folks don't have jury. You got a couple Cuba. more games. <laughs> you got a couple more games yeah. for the jury, nigga. Yeah, not, not a couple in more this games. Game. Oh, they got that? Oh, shit, bro. Damn, they could. Don't worry, we'll get a jury at some point. <laughs> Eventually. Eventually. Either way, they better stop trying to be different because there's no point. Y'all look the same. Losers. <laughs> <What's> up, <nigga>? <laughs> Anyways. You should hate them for real. Let's so. go, my nigga. If we can find the reason for Discord in her heart, we should be able to draw <laughs> even out more. We should be able to draw even more new testimony out. New testimony. <clears throat> he getting crossed up. I tried to well, run, uh, but I was too slow. I'll just read these because I think you've actually played the game now. Um, mm -hmm. hold on. Well, 
autoplay. I don't, I don't know. I, whatever. I I tried to run, but I was too slow. Next. Before I could get away. Next. Back. I was. No, no, no. Oh, God, <laughs> and then the rubble started falling on me. I thought I was done for. Okay. Next. Oh, see, look, she got the direct view. Alright. No dick. Okay. Oh, so is that why she's sad? Because oh. it's, it's not as big as she was hoping. Oh. I think she's because he got the body. Yeah, we're gonna kill oh, bro, we're cracking it down. We're cracking it down. Okay. Um. And plane. So now what do we do? Yeah, do that. Oh, sad. Yes. Yeah, that's the new one, I guess. Yes. Hmm. I guess sad. Yeah. I mean, it's never really expected. Yeah. Fuck. You were happy when Mr. Justice rescued you, weren't you? Yes, I was really happy. Yeah. Was there also something you felt sad about at the same time? Sad? <laughs> the reason I ask is... When you were describing how you were rescued, we sensed a little sadness, too. Maybe some worry. Depression. I... I think it was probably because of... Bum Rap Rainy. If his skin color looks like mine, I'm gonna be pissed. Bum Rap Rainy? Well, what do you know? Something new. That's right. I have the most lips. I brought my stuffed animal. Bum Rap Rainy to watch the trial with me. <laughs> Bum Rap Rainy and Pony Fanty are brothers. <laughs> what the fuck is she talking about right now? Who knew that the legal world could, could inspire a whole line of merchandise? I had Bum Rap Rainy with me when I was watching the trial. But it wasn't up until Apollo saved me that I realized I lost him when I was running away. My poor Riney, the victim of that terrible bomb. Oh, I know. You can see what he looks like from this poster. No more bum rap. <laughs> it's a campaign to eradicate fake evidence and false charges. <laughs> <laughs> Phony Fancy and Bum Rap Riney, huh? It's just the cover to <laughs> Bobby Tarantino. Oh no. I saw the vinyl for Bobby Tarantino 3 at the at the bookstore. I didn't get that though. I got Joji and uh KOD by J. Cole. There was a woman there that was like actually like beautiful okay, nothing against the campaign, but why an elephant and a rhinoceros? It's the right. I don't, I don't sense any Discord in Junie's heart anymore. So I guess that means we managed to draw out all of her testimony. That's right. I'll just make an update with this new info and we'll have the whole picture. So, do you think her new testimony will help? Absolutely. I don't know what I would have done without you, Athena. Moi. So Bum Rap Riney was in the courtroom when the bomb went off. Now that we know that, it changes the meaning of that other piece of evidence. Ah, yeah. All I have to do is present it. At the right statement. I was watching from the gallery with Bum Rap Riney and tried to run, but I was too slow. Yeah, we know about that next... Before I could get out of the courtroom, the bomb went off. Awesome shit. I was so startled, I tripped. Then the rubble started falling. I thought I was done for. You should have been, but next. But then Apollo came and rescued me. I'm over it. Oh, that's know. it. Um, <laughs> look at what we have. It's the gay ass tail, but I don't know where to put it at. Um, let me see what it says, though. These are the stuffed animal that had the bomb be inserted into. So you put that at the beginning? <clears throat> the defendant's fingerprints. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, yeah, it belongs to that. Oh god. Yeah. Oh, no. Objection! You got the wrong tail. <sighs> Miss Woods, I know this trial has been very hard for you. But you can relax now. You are without a doubt innocent. I cannot wait to see a lot of heart in this game. <laughs> I that already. <laughs> he doesn't know. <laughs> Does he know? Uh, what, is she dead? <laughs> Don't make me kill myself. <laughs> Continue, I think, Blue. I think he'll yeah, be yeah, mad just... when he sees the DLC case of this game. Oh boy. <laughs> Mr. Wright. What wild assertion are you making now? My wild assertion is simply this. The two stuffed niggas were mixed up. The tail the defendant's fingerprints were found on wasn't that of phony fanty. It was the tail of her gallery companion, Bum Rap Rhymey. Bum Rap Logic. <laughs> he doesn't deserve it. <laughs> what nonsense is that? Blame Blue, he's a bad influence on me. Mm -hmm. Blame Logic, niggas trash. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding, guys. I it's okay. Frank, Frank. Yes. But they're completely different characters. An elephant and a rhino. They're as distinct as a defense lawyer and a prosecutor. Not what but are they really so true. different? Especially after the last game. Both defense lawyers and prosecutors strive to protect the peace through law. Even elephants and rhinos have some similar characteristics. They're both gray. <laughs> well, it starts with Good color. Job, anyway, uh, this poster is all like. like nuts for their uh, tusks. W too. nuts. This poster They're is both... all I need to prove my assertion to be true. They're also both mammals. That works. If I may direct the court's attention here, you'll clearly see how they, how the two got mixed up. Hello, are we pointing to the tail? Or is that worth pointing to? I, don't know, I wasn't paying attention. I, I guess that. Sure, like just so that thing. she'll be wrong, and then everyone laugh at her. Wow, Joe, look at that! The two tails. Well, exactly I just realized. I believe this. I believe this is like the game's pursuit theme. In this game. Yes, exacto mundo. The two stuffed animals are based on entirely different Bing Boings. But the design of their tails is exactly the same! This hair just went flat, but. <laughs> yeah, his hair is fake! Fake! Phony! I want some fucking order and a spot. I talk about your weed right now. As long as the possibility exists that the tail belongs to Bum Rap Rhiney, we can no longer consider it decisive proof that the defendant handled the bomb. As things stand, I consider the charges against our accused of substantiated. Yeah. Wouldn't you agree, Mr. Fuck Nigga? Um. Yes, of course, Your Honor. Well, that was great, Mr. Wright. You turned things right round. You know me, bro. It's not over yet, though. But at least we managed to hold out this long. I believe that brings our proceedings for today to a close. Are you serious? Mr. Payne, I'm afraid you have some serious investigating ahead of you. Yes, your honor. I'm very wrong. Let us reconvene tomorrow. It's a jerk. Nigga, that was barely a nine to five. You just. Are you hunting? <laughs> I'm going home. <laughs> December 17th, 11 56 a.m. In district court. <laughs> Defendant lobby number five. Mambo number five. That was exciting, boss! We did it! True to form, he managed to just barely pull it off at the very last moment. <laughs> Somehow! Tugging and shit. True to form? Gee, I never knew you had such a glowing opinion of me. <laughs> you did great, Miss Woods. You really suck. I mean, you really <laughs> suck it out. <laughs> Alright. Just so negative. What the fuck? 
And you got really brave at the end, just when we needed you the most. You didn't vanish, Junie. Thanks to you, we were able to turn things around. Well, you were the ones who gave me that cur- You were the one who gave me that courage, Dana. Really? <laughs> Thanks. So let's be honest, was I any help at all? Of hell course. No, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> Without you, hell we would have no. never gotten out of that tight spot. Alright, well that too. It's good to hear. <laughs> I may still have a lot to learn, but you can bet I'm gonna give it my all. 100%. I'll be so good that one day you'll call me your partner. That's what I like to hear. Analytical psychology. The ability to solve the riddles of a person's heart. Adina's true potential is beginning to really shine through now. Hey, uh, where did Apollo go? Hmm, good question. I almost forgot about him. He's dead. I assumed he'd still be in here in the lobby. All the blood from his head stopped oh. gushing. Yeah, I know. Maybe he's still in courtroom number four. Courtroom number four? What would he be doing at the scene of the explosion? When I came out of the lobby to rest, I told Apollo about Bumrap Riney. I told him I dropped Riney in the courtroom as I was trying to escape before the blast. And then... Apollo said he had an idea where Riney might be. So he went back to take a look- we went back to take a look together. Let me find that nigga under more rubble somehow. Huh, I guess Apollo can be pretty nice when he wants to be. So that's supposed to mean. So you went looking for Riney together before you were called back into courtroom number five? Yes. I had some time to rest, so I was able to go back and look for him. But then they called me into the courtroom. And then they called me into courtroom number five to testify. Where's Apollo insisted on staying there, though. With all those injuries? Wonder how he's managing. I think Apollo might have figured something out. Hmm, I wonder what it was. He told me, I'm going to look for evidence to clear your name, Juniper. Just maybe he found some new piece of evidence. Anyway, we better get go and get him. Good idea. December 17th, 12-11 p.m. District Court, courtroom number four. Where are you, Apollo? Fine. Trial's over for today! Nigga died. I know you're... <gasps> no! I knew he died. We call it. <laughs> Oops. Damn. I think he just tripped. Oops. <laughs> Damn. The screen. Damn, he's really washed. <laughs> <laughs> he really should have went to the hospital. Well, he died before Gumshoe. Be continued. He really should have went to the hospital. Table, shut the fuck up.